there's not many schools, I don't know if you guys know this, but a lot of schools, considering volleyball season and softball season at the same time, and a lot of times they compete with the same kids, they don't get along very well a lot of the time. And I can honest, honestly say that um, Coach Beckley is one of my best friends here at school, and um, we definitely work well together, and we support each other 110%, and I love that. Thank you. Um, okay, uh, a couple of thank yous, and I'm going to get going. I'm going to go fast, because I'm going to come in. Um, <laughs> Booster Club, obviously, for putting this on. Faculty, staff, administration, cooks. Um, all my volleyball parents, you guys did amazing keeping these girls fed and getting them everywhere on time and everything. And all of our tournaments, there was a smorgasbord of food. Um, it was wonderful. Uh, Michelle Walquist, thank you for doing the book and stepping in and doing line judge and saving my dad on a few games. Um, Astro games. Um, <laughs> thank you to the Downings, Mike and Nancy. They're not here, but um, they help a ton. Nancy still helps out. And a lot of the pictures that hopefully we can get um, our uh, video going, uh, Coach Downing and Mike Downing uh, provided. Also, Nathaniel Padgett with Go Fair Grove. He also helped us out with a few pictures on our video that you guys are going to see here shortly, hopefully. Um, my parents, which they already left with my kiddos, you guys saw that. My dad line judges, Matt keeps score, so that leaves somebody has to take care of the kids. Well, it's Anne and A for a few minutes until my parents get there. <laughs> and then my mom takes over, so a big thank you to them. And then my husband, he is a single parent during volleyball season, and he's always a little bit excited when the season ends. He's ready for me to come home. Um, and then last but not least is my new assistant, um, Sarah Branoff, and I think I was standoffish at the beginning. Just kidding. Um, I actually, what's funny is, like, we got along way a long time ago. Like, I coached her, if you guys didn't know that, um, and kind of led her in youth group and did all kinds of stuff, and so I knew her from way back when, so it was just kind of, we walked in and it was like we just clicked and we just went from there. So um, she is, I'm going to use Coach Beckley's word, phenomenal. Her knowledge of this game made our team what? Made, made the team that it is today. Okay, and it was her help and she was wonderful. Okay, I can tell tons of stories about the level and I don't have time to do it because I am on time limit. Um, so I can't talk about how Haley Stallings has a no talking in the federal rules, or um, how Sarah had to leave doing lines during the varsity game because she had to go throw up in the back room, which is less a lot. She's doing she's line judging. I can't talk about how Morgan side of the gym walking out of a poor falls flat on her face and the breath cup falls off the breath stand because she's laughing so hard. Um, I mean, I have story after story after story to tell, but I can't. So. Um, I'm going to talk about the freshman and the JV first. So when I call your guys' name, you guys can come here and stand. Freshman, Shay Wallace, Emily Derrick, Kelly O'Klotnick, Skylar Kinsinger, Kirsten Carver, Sierra Lennox, Bailey Weaver, and Sarah Wall. Woo! Woo!
Coach B and I may have a lineup on one game, the next game it's completely changed. And then the next game it's completely changed again. So these group of girls, they don't get comfortable playing next to the same people every single game. We switch it up all the time. Um, and they, they roll with it. So they finished the season with a record of 16-6. and six, And they had a second place finish in the Fairgrove tournament. Um, and, you know, they're young. And like I said about the freshman group, this group of kids, um, they're going to contribute to Fairgrove Volleyball for years to come. And I'm excited to see them. So this is our freshman and JV group. Close the blocks of the middle. The list goes on and on and on and on and on. 
and on. Um, last year she played three rotations front row. This year she played six rotations all the way around. Um, this girl does her job and never, ever, ever complains. I get to her complain. Um, she has received second team all district, honorable mention all conference, and she leads the team with 197 digs and a 2.2 serve receive out of a 3.0, and that's Aaliyah Cooper. Okay, our next senior, 
Um, this is a girl that maybe when she was a freshman, I should have gave her the Halo style and Jewel too. They're like two people in the pot. I think they were excited that I called them two people in the pot. Um, now, this girl, like I have seen her get stronger and stronger and stronger every season. And I knew from a freshman year that she was going to do great things on the court for Fairbury Volleyball. And she's one of those middles that I don't, I think a lot of people overlooked. Um, she's just a skinny little thing, no one really pays much attention to her. And until they blo until she blocks them, or she gets the kills on them. And I really think she started turning it on about mid-season and, and really picked it up. And, was averaging a lot more kills halfway through the season until the end of the season, and always closing the block, always doing the little things. She even had to learn to set this year a little bit, um, and did great at that. And she also received a lot of recognition this year, and that was second team all region, first team all district, and second team all conference, and that goes to Anna Day Mock Jones. But these aren't really that goofy, but they fit all these kids. The first one I have 
um, is our Hustle Award. And this kid, from day one to the very last day, was busting it. No matter if she's playing freshman, she's playing JV, if she's playing BS, or if she was setting, because we kind of threw her into some weird positions, especially at the beginning. Always, always hustling, and that goes to Bailey Weaver. Thank you. 